Hey guys, my name is Elijah. In this tutorial, I will show you how to add keyframes in Shotcut. So in order to add keyframes, you will first need filter or effect that you will be keyframing. So choose your video, go over to filters and add filter that you want to be keyframing. In my case, it will be a position, a size position and rotate. So double click on that. And I want to keyframe this effect uh, particularly. So let's say zoom and position. So make your um, playhead at the beginning of your clip, click on this stopwatch. And now, as you can see, this keyframe has been appearing here. You can move it. So let's say I will move it somewhere around here a second. And here is the starting point. So in, at this time of the video, all of these parameters stay like this. I will move my playhead to different time. And at this time of the video, I will change the parameters. So let's say I will change the zoom. I will change the position. So let's say I'll move it like so a little bit. And I can also change uh, here uh, the size right here. You can change it in pixels. So that's it. this is how you do it. And now when I play it back, you will see it zooms in and goes to left, exactly how I said it. Now you can move it closer to make it faster, as you can see. Now it just zooms in and you can probably also, oops, go back to keyframes if this happens. By the way, if you only see this mode, go to keyframes down here. And then you can also set up another keyframe. You can set it a multiple keyframes and zoom in even further or zoom out even further, as you can see. And you really feel free to play with this. You can do it in any effect and in any filter. So thank you guys for watching. If this video was helpful to you, consider subscribing and liking this video and I will see you in the next tutorial. Bye bye.